Starting today and on Sundays through the rest of the summer, Detroit public school leaders say they will be going to area churches delivering the message. Students need to be in school on day one. It was praise plus a message from DPS emergency manager Roy Roberts at churches in Detroit today. Roberts asking congregations to take leadership. He says Detroit students need to be in school on the first day and every day. Last year, kids who didn't get to school on time and late in the state uh, threatened to charge us $25 million. Well, that's, we can't throw away $25 million. The visits come as the district's leaders deal with shifting powers. A judge this week ruled Roberts will keep financial control of the district, but gave the school board academic control. This after a state law giving emergency managers sweeping powers was set aside pending a November vote. Robert says despite changes, parents should have confidence in DPS. We're going to fight for stability. Uh, I'm not going to be ultra concerned about the school board or anybody else. My goal was to make sure we have a great startup of school, that we do the right thing for kids. Outside churches, parents greeted churchgoers. Sonia Smith has two daughters in Detroit schools, Melanie and Madison. She says she is out here because she believes the district can thrive with community support. It's important that our kids see that we're involved in the system that they're in, that we trust our children to be in every day. Detroit Public Schools will be back in session on September 4th. In Detroit, Kim Russell, 7 Action.